hi guys welcome to my youtube channel it's your girl dida and i'm back i've missed you so much guys that's why i'm even here doing this video because first guys i was very unwell and god has healed me for like two and a half weeks and i'm okay so i'm going to obey i'm going to obey him i'm going to do this video i know this topic is controversial but i feel it in my heart to do it and i know it's going to help a soul one day or two and that's me like i just want to live a life of impact guys before i start these are my opinions opinion opinion op whatever so guys if you've ever struggled to achieve this gift let me know if you've ever desired to have it let me know if you've ever faked let me know if you've ever talked bad about the people who will do it let me know but guys before we even start i want you to just take two seconds and repent and tell god that you're sorry for even imitating the people who speak in tongues i see some people even go to an extent of talking about people who are anointed for this generation and mimicking how they speak in tongues i'm like you guys are you crazy do you know these curses might follow you up to four generations let me tell you guys i'm here as a vessel i'm not a perfect one i'm not like a the religious person but i believe if you have this desire in your heart god will watch it to fulfillment god will give it to you if you desire to speak in tongues this is your video if you have that inside desire like i want to attain this gift this is your video guys and i'm telling you it's possible i used to desire so much i used to send so many mails to even these websites that are godly like godly life and they tell them hey i desire to receive this gift and they used to encourage me that you can but you're supposed to pray about it but now guys every time i could subject myself to prayers the devil could remind me of my weaknesses of my sins and take my mind off that desire and ninge kutata sija receive that gift so i'm here to tell you guys it's possible it's possible as long as you believe in god and you've accepted christ as your personal savior it's possible to receive that gift of speaking in tongues you know guys let me tell you we are righteous we are not perfect we are all in a journey of perfection guys but no one is perfect we are all righteous we are all righteous people and we all carry the spirit of god so i don't really care what you did last night or what you 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 do as long as you repent guys you are worthy to stand before god you are worthy to even give god god your desires guys so i'm going to tell you this i used to desire so much i even remember my cousin joan she invited me to her church it's a nigerian church back then and i know she's my fan hi joan and every time i used to be prayed for to receive the, the gifts of speaking in tongues i used to feel like these people are playing with my mind and they are just wasting my time because i didn't believe it and most of them they used to tell me repeat these things after me say these words after me i didn't want that i wanted something that will come out from my spirit that's that something that will come out from my belly i didn't want something that is just cooked and like i didn't want to fake it guys i know so many people are faking it right now so many men are faking it to even get attention of women in churches guys you don't have to fake it we all sorry we all carry the spirit of god we all carry the same spirit that raised christ jesus from death why should we not speak in tongues why should we not communicate to god guys i'm a witness at times you might go through so much in life such that you don't even know what to tell god you don't know even what to pray for you know and god works in season and it's only our our spirit that designs this the seasons that we are in guys so i want you to understand that speaking in tongues is the most powerful thing that you can have it's the most powerful gift that you can have like in this generation it's the most powerful gift it's the most important thing that you can ask god for 
in intercession like while praying in tongues this is where god gives you even a direction of your life god gives you even ideas on how your life should be on what to do with your life on the ministry that he laid down for you here on earth you know so guys i'm going to share with you uh, important things like your future is in revelation not in information and how will you attain your revelation it's through intercession so guys you cannot operate with a carnal mind you cannot you're supposed to discern and it's your spirit that discerns the things of god so for you to be able to discern you're supposed to subject yourself to intercession intercession is not for the perfect people intercession is not for the righteous people it's for the people who have accepted Jesus as their personal savior okay if you believe in Jesus you can speak in tongues so guys i want to take you slowly at times we play our lives with trial and error but god is calling us to intercession this is where that in intercession it's not a game of trial and error it's about you communicating your heart desires to god okay and guys let me tell you something i remember there was a day i was so depressed so i went and told holy spirit to fill me and that day guys i felt so much joy joy that no alcohol alcohol could give me no weed could give me no nothing could give me i felt the real authentic joy the joy that does not leave your heart empty and every human being living in this earth has a space for god in their heart so whenever you feel empty ask yourself what is missing is it the spirit of god that is missing okay so guys i remember that day after i prayed yes i didn't speak in tongues but i laughed i laughed like there's that holy spirit boldness that comes and Holy Spirit can manifest in new in different ways because that day I just laughed. I laughed a laughter that I've never laughed. You see like you feel so much joy, a priceless joy, joy that no one can give you. Like that's what I'm talking about right now. So I joined JCC Parkland around 2018 and here in this church we pray before the service we pray during the service and after the service in tongues so guys i used to go to church and i'm like i'm just looking at everyone i was in anafanya cuz me i couldn't fake it i was tired but i knew that it's a design my heart so i became deep with god i started going for intercession and that's how god gave me that gift i remember this this specific day my friend his very spiritual is called John D. It was like it's a, it was a, a wedding first that Saturday was was it Saturday or Friday it was on Friday I'm not sure guys I don't want to lie but we went for a wedding and after Johnny was like hey Tasha sit on the to the intercession so Johnny was always holding my hand to kind of come back Johnny me I, I can't speak in tongues and uku please please ignore those noises kuna mafundi uku na uku kila mtu anaomba in tanks for the whole night akaniambia you tasha don't worry let's go so he used to hold my hand when praying when praying but do see receive a gift so another day if it's not the same same day but guys i'm my I'm, i think i'm ahead of myself but there's this specific day I went to see some kids in the street. I took for them gifts. Then we went for intercession. Yes, I'm telling you. That day nearly sweat the whole body because I, I remember before we started praying, I told God, God, if you're real, reveal yourself through me tonight. 
hey, don't joke with that prayer. Don't joke, don't joke, don't joke. Because can you imagine? God revealed himself through me. Nearly sweat. My voice ili kwa kama like in a groan. Guys, I was filled. I spoke in tongues the whole night. The whole night. Siku tulia. Even this story nilikuwa na poana my friends cuz me sikujua how it went cuz I was filled the whole night but not the problem that was on Saturday Sunday in Africa nimeenda intercession asubuhi at around 6 before the main service nimefika sikumbuki tanga ta moja mimi nikamwambia god god me sikumbuki tanga but i don't want to fake it help me cuz that intercession had like i think three or two people so nilikuwa nimeona ah here to see the receive gift you leo leo see the speaking tank i'm telling you my spirit connected i was filled i was filled i was filled i prayed i prayed i prayed guys you know the good thing of praying in tanks you end up even praying for people in the hospital you end up even praying for people who have different kind of needs you end up standing on their behalf you end up like una 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 fight na devil your time so hey guys it was the best thing ever there's nothing like the presence of god like from that day i desired i desired to go deeper guys but let me tell you the more you go deeper the more god gives you more revelations the more your life like people won't understand you people won't understand you especially people who know your past they won't understand you because guys i'm telling you god reveals things to you bako mwenye uko like apana no i i have to stop going deeper so get it reached to a point i was going deeper maka i could even design some secrets about even men who are approaching me hey hey but who is the devil the more you go deeper into god the more you get more temptations the more devil like devil na kutafuta cuz he's not happy with you cuz i remember those days guys i used to go and pray for people i used to and even people could get healed one thing i've learned with the, with my journey is guys i'm telling you if you desire to speak in tongues god will give you that gift and god will use you as wretched as you are One thing about God, God is not looking for perfect people. Even in the Bible, he was not using perfect people. God is you looking for people who are willing who are willing to get used. And how will you be willing to get used? You have to surrender to his will and desires that he has for your life. Like for me to do this video, I was like, ah, ah, I don't want to do this. I don't want to sound churchy. I don't want to sound spiritual but guys i have that burden in my heart so i'll do it if you want to judge me go ahead but me anything that god puts in my heart i'll do it so uh holy spirit reveals specific wisdom that we need to live and overcome life he imparts gifts as he wills Holy Spirit helps us in our prayers for we do not know how to pray you know and Holy Spirit is the owner of the authentic joy guys even when you need destiny connectors always pray for them personally guys me have not even had one person or two people telling me kwa njia nimeambwa na Holy Spirit nisimame nikubebe even the other day God connects you to your destiny connectors through intercession. Like all the desires of your heart God connects. Yani I just don't know guys. I don't feel like I'm the one speaking today. I feel like Woo. Anyway guys, it's like it's simple. I want you to desire to speak in tongues whether you're a sinner as you feel in your head desire to speak in tongues desire to communicate to god on a personal level okay 
and for me uh, I love listening to Victoria she's called Victoria uh, I can't remember the other name but she prays in tongues and she worships in tongues so every time I want to be in the presence of God I'll switch off everything and I'll listen to her and she'll take me deeper so one thing I've learned if you want to go deeper with God look for people who are deeper and connect with them because them for them to access that atmosphere it's much easier for them compared to you who you you still like still confused in this carnal mind and carnal reality so you can always connect with people who are deeper like victoria orenze i think that's her name and she's so powerful and also you can tell god you can tell god god i desire to speak to you in the unknown tongues in the tongues of fire god i want to communicate to you god i want you to show me the path that you want me to take because god i don't want to live just a normal life god i want to live the life that you created me for and god is too faithful god is too faithful to give you that but the devil is in the work of trying to show you that you're a mess you're not guys you're not a mess i don't care what you've been through but you're not a mess as long as god has given you a chance to see each day just tell him what you desire in your heart tell him that you really desire to have that gift so guys i'm here to tell you that it's possible i know if you've clipped I know if you've clicked on this video, you really desire to speak in tongues. So, what you'll do, pray about it, go for intercession, be serious about it. Na wambe mungu, mimi sita tukapa belo janipe yu gift. Okay? Be serious about it and go for intercession. So guys, now the issue is, uh, I started uh, doing ushering those two days. So at times uh, during the service to Kambiwa, if you want to speak in tongues when they come at times I could take people uh, receive the gifts of speaking in tongues. I end up getting filled. And I'm an usher, trust you. And as an usher, you're not supposed to go deep because a lot. Like my spirit connects. Sure. So anyway, and I guess it's just the best thing ever. So um, I believe that if you want to walk in accuracy, just desire to speak in tongues. God will give you discernment, and you don't have to be perfect to do all this. But guess I'll just encourage each one of you to pray for that gift and stop judging the people who have it because guys uh, we have so many gifts we have the gifts of prophecy the gifts of interpreting tongues i really desire to know how to interpret my tongues i see people with the gift of interpretation they are very as if i just desire i want to know what i'm saying you know at times you might get filled even don't know what you're saying but your spirit is just in a home by number by number so uh, there's interpreting in tongues there is uh, guys you know those gifts there's so many and you can pray for one but the one that you never go wrong with is speaking in tongues speaking in tongues speaking in tongues i remember when i was sick like this past three weeks I could not even pray, but guys, I could just find my spirit praying for me, praying for me, praying for me, like the Bible says, out of the belly will flow the streams of living water. I hope I've said it as it is. So it's possible, desire and I love you guys it's possible if you decide and tell God about it I love you I don't have much to say I hope that was 
impactful. Tell me about your experiences on receiving the gifts of speaking in tongues and how it went. And if you out there talking bad about people who have the gift, it's a high time you stop and repent. So see you in my next video guys. Love you. Mwah.